Hello my multi-millionaires over there on the other side and everybody who's benefiting of this system that we live in. Today I want to talk to you about conformity and how you cannot make or create a non-conformist society. Conformity in itself, is it good or bad? Well, think about Nazi Germany. That was pretty bad conformity, you know. And then think about something like the Rastafari's, you know. They are conformists, you know. They have their own groups and their own methods, you know. Think about Buddhist monks. They're conformists. Think about Christians. They're fucking conformists. And the truth of the matter is that are these people really sharing the same values? Are these really is all the kind of unification or the unity of any kind of group, is it all an illusion? Is there really something deep that connects these people to each other in any way? Or is it just, you know, human beings trying to search for connection where there is not anything, you know? I'm gonna say that non the non-conformist society doesn't exist because, and it cannot be created, um, because that would entail people having their own ideas, you know, whatever it might be. And conformity is adopting the ideas of the group, you know, as your own, creating this identity around whatever kind of idea what it might be, you know. And I think that's in itself, is it good or bad? Well, it depends on the group, you know. But there's a lot of bad conformity. There's a lot of bad conformity, you know. Just be wary of that.